Hello YouTube and uh, all the ham radio operators out there. This is Kilo Delta 2 Alpha Victor Uniform. Uh, Tim here. Uh, today we're gonna do some antenna work. So let's start to bring up this design I came up with. Uh, it's a 222 six element Yagi antenna a design. And uh, let's open up this uh, antenna. And the uh, antenna is simulation program here. This antenna works okay in the attic and uh, it fits the space. But uh, then um, I decided to upgrade this antenna a little bit to uh, a little bit longer boom and maybe one more element. Okay, let's run some calculations. Um, so the prediction is uh, the SWR is 1.15 and uh, it's okay, it's 1.16 in uh, free space. Okay, let's look at the uh, gain uh, number here. It's uh, 8.82 dBD, so which is pretty good. And uh, then we go on, but uh, the front and back ratio is 11.7 dB. So let's take a look at the pattern. And you're seeing uh, a big, big block at the end of the antenna pattern. So. Uh, that's why the front back ratio is not good. Um, when I was designing this antenna, uh, I just wanted to uh, squeeze out the most gain, forward gain of this antenna. But uh, if you're an uh, extra and you study the extra uh, test question pool, you will know that if you're increasing the uh, forward gain and uh, the back side of the uh, antenna pattern, uh, the gain will increase as well. So, uh, this is what happened. And I got very poor uh, back rejections uh, by using this antenna. So, during a contest, I can hear both um, uh, front and back uh, of other stations. But uh, anyway, uh, let's bring up the uh, new design. seven element right here so this is the new design I came up with and uh, the boom lens is uh, a little over five feet so I can squeeze this antenna in between the uh, 2 meter and 432 stack the driven element is uh, 3 eighths of, of an, an inch so it's uh, approximately uh, 9.5 mil, and uh, all the other elements were uh, 6.375 mil, which is a uh, quarter inch. Um, and uh, I'm gonna be talking about uh, the material I'm using. Um, basically, uh, the boom is just. Uh, square uh, aluminum square tubing that I get from uh, Home Depot or Lowe's and uh, all the aluminum tubing round tubing I got online uh, it's either 6061 uh, material or 6063 material and uh, I use Delring uh, for uh, in element insulators Anyway, let's run some uh, simulation here. And uh, as you can see, the SWR is 1.03. And uh, let's see the free space gain. Uh, it's a 9.76 dBD gain. And um, I've looked it up uh, on the internet. Uh, the company M Square Antenna has a similar 7 element 222 beam. And uh, the gain is about the same. And uh, the boom length is about the same. So and let's look at the antenna pattern and uh, you're going to see the uh, gain on the back is much, much lower than uh, what it was before. The pattern looks good. I decided to just go ahead and uh, execute this design. Let's look at another thing. When I designed this antenna, I kept in mind that um, I should be designed in a wide band antenna instead of uh, concentrating on getting the most gain out of it and uh, the more gain 
the narrower the bandwidth. So let's do some plotting here. And um, bandwidth, let's put in uh, 6,000 kc. And uh, let's run the uh, simulation here. And let's see the SWR curve. It's pretty nice. Um, all the way to 225, and it's less than 1.5. It's not bad at all. And uh, you can see the um, antenna pattern doesn't change much. So, which is a good thing. So, anyway, uh, let's just jump right into uh, how I make this antenna. Okay, now we're looking at the uh, um, Delrin insulator here, and also the uh, coax choke on the feed point. Uh, this is a different antenna, but uh, uh, usually I use these type of uh, constructions for all my antennas, uh, Yagi antenna. Okay, we're gonna test the uh, SWR now, the antenna uh, put in the attic. Uh, so it's pretty good uh, SWR. Um, so we we'll key up. <coughs> Transverter is putting on around like uh, 20 watts or so. And uh, I put my uh, call sign out there. And uh, then uh, we switching on the amplifier. So that'll put out around like 150 watt. So let's see. A little. Not bad, really. Still one point less than 1.1. It's close to 150, 140. And now we're. Signal faded here and uh, turning the antenna more. Now I'm turning the antenna back to the beacon. And, uh, the signal is no option. Anyway, uh, if you like my videos, uh, like, share, comment below, and uh, subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching. This is Kilo Delta 2 Alpha Victor Uniform 673. Until next.
next time.